today. Now, it won't be as cold tomorrow, but it is going to be very wet. That kicks in from tomorrow afternoon. Uh, we've also got some very severe weather happening further north this evening. I'll tell you more about that, and I'll bring you the full Queensland forecast when I see you in half an hour. All right, thanks, Amanda. Speak to you soon. Well, little ones at the Royal Children's Hospital had a special visitor today. Santa delivered Christmas gifts to hundreds of kids and their families who need some cheering up. Another generous man, Stefan, started up the appeal, spreading joy to hospitals right across the state. Only one very VIP could get this kind of elaborate escort. The big man himself, Santa. He's delivering toys and Christmas cheer to kids who need it most. The annual Stefan Toy Drive brought big smiles to some very brave faces, like Zeke Sinclair. It's really wonderful. He brings a smile back to his face. He's looking sad this morning. Stefan has been doing this for the past 10 years. And I remember when my son was at hospital, when I turned up with a gift, he was smiling and there's no pain. Nowadays, he delivers presents to 13 major hospitals and not just toys. And she'll give you all the things you need for her, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you what so more could so a girl strong. want? <laughs> Thank you so much. Police thrilled to be a part of this special kids' force. See their courage and just how dignified they are, you know, in the face of the adversity. It, it truly, uh, this is a very worthy thing to do for them. This visit has become a real highlight for families, many who will be spending Christmas Day in hospital. This Christmas, young Zeke has just one wish. Just to get better. Yeah. Jessica Turner, 10 News. Up next, it's been a bad day for the federal government. A major energy policy is dumped after an embarrassing defeat on the mining tax. Then, the white Christmas travel night...